Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to fix the setup did not find any hard disk drives installed in your computer. I'm referring to this message here when installing Windows XP. This is one of many solutions. So, let's begin. Uh, go ahead and start your computer. Depending on your computer model, it will ask you to press F2, escape, or delete to enter the setup. In this case, it's F2. This is going to take you to the BIOS. In the BIOS, select the main tab. And here, go to where it says SATA mode and change AHCI mode to IDE mode F10 to save your settings and then enter to restart the computer I created this video because of a client I went to see I did this and it worked but that doesn't mean is the only solution to this problem in the future I'll be posting two more tutorials to help you fix this issue Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, please feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.